just had the most horrible dream that there was a zero day vulnerability in the Windows Print Spooler. Seriously? Ah, oh, pants. <laughs> Microsoft recently patched a bug in the Windows Print Spooler service that initially they thought was just local privilege escalation, but unfortunately it turns out it's also full remote code execution. What's worse is it turns out the patch doesn't totally work. And it looks like there's three POC exploits for this bug. Penny, Penny, inside girl. That means an attacker can get full domain admin privileges just by executing code as a standard user. That could be anything from a pretty bad phishing attack to a malicious insider. There are tons of ways a malicious actor could execute this exploit. But since it does require credentials, this probably won't be as bad as something like WannaCry. It's the middle of the day. This is a nasty bug, and the most recent patch doesn't fix it. Be on the lookout for an out-of-band patch from Microsoft, and if it drops, I'd install it right away. Until a new patch, all you can really do is disable your print spooler service on your domain controller. I understand that can be pretty disruptive to business operations, but it's probably less disruptive than full-blown ransomware. Besides, we're all supposed to be moving to paperless anyway. To get more details, check out the blog post at rapid7.com. Thanks for watching.